So, uh, going ahead, what else are you going to be working hard on? Oh, uh, what else means uh, I'll be just diversing more in, in terms of the pipeline mm-hmm. stuff, or what we can offer mm-hmm. as also a first Malaysian tissue engineering based company. Mm-hmm. You know, other than that, uh, we try to help more people. Mm-hmm. Uh, addressing more indications, more problems in medicine. That's what mm-hmm. we're trying to go for. Um, I'll be staying here, of course, in the same uh, field uh, mm-hmm. to help more people and eventually help the country to establish uh, to to establish uh, uh, to establish ourselves as a tissue engineering hub for right. the region. Very tall order. Uh, yet the work has already started and you've mm. already done some of the work. Mm. Um, I'm sure you didn't do it alone. I'm sure you had a lot of people helping behind yes. you and, and, and you had funding and all. You know, talk to us about some of the support that you received. Yeah, um, the whole process took around 15 years. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it started in 1999, that time when I was still in university. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, but thank God, uh, Malaysian government really take this as something serious, something that will create wealth for the mm-hmm. nation, of course, but also helping more people. They really acknowledged that and they helped mm-hmm. in terms of the research stage for 10 years mm-hmm. and the funding for the funding for the commercialization stage. Mm-hmm. That's another two years. Mm-hmm. And again, adding up to another three years, altogether mm-hmm. 15 years. 15 is for 15 million mm-hmm. uh, from Mosty, from uh, UKM, and also especially from MTDC. So from MTDC as without well. all this assistance, this thing will never happen because it needs lots of work, lots mm-hmm. of brain, lots of hands, everything has to be in place in order to have this. The question that, that still uh, beckons to be asked is, um, despite uh, the, 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 the notion that um, if you're doing something with uh, biomedical sciences or, or you know medicine, uh, you don't need to commercialize it because there's always going to be a need for new stuff so why do you need to commercialize of course if it's not commercialized everything that we do in the lab Mm -hmm. will just stay in the bench Mm -hmm. and no patient will benefit from it so Mm -hmm. that's the whole total waste you know so lucky that we have a government especially MTDC Mm -hmm. to uh, to fund uh, the gap that we have from the bench going to the patient yeah that's the critical gap, uh, mm-hmm. phase that we have mm-hmm. to really address and mm-hmm. MTD, MTDC is addressing it by giving, uh, by providing uh, assistance in terms of funding mm-hmm. for speci- specifically for spe- commercialization. Right, okay, yeah. so MTDC, you know, uh, a body like MTDC doesn't just stop at providing you the funds to develop the, the technology, but yeah. it goes all the way through. Yes, uh, for development of the technologies by Mosty, for mm-hmm. example, and then now, okay, we want to commercialize it, we want to, s- we want to have it used by the patient. So who's going to find that? There comes MTDC in place. <laughs>